One of the exciting things about being board chair this year, the, the hundredth anniversary of, of ASAE, is that you have a chance to stop and reflect some, um, not just on the profession, but on my role. Uh, in the profession. And, and one of the things that's really important to me to communicate to, to everyone is that I've had a, a wonderful uh, opportunity to go up through the ASAE ranks and become chair, but I am just an association professional like, like everyone else. Um, nothing different, nothing special, just a, a passion, just some commitment. And um, someone years ago, when she, in fact, was coming up to become board chair, stopped me one day at an annual meeting. Out of nowhere, I didn't know Arlene Pytranton at all, but she stopped me and she said, how are you doing? And I said, and I knew, I knew who she was, and I was awed that the, the chair of the ASAE board would stop and say anything to anyone. Um, and she engaged me in conversation for a few minutes, and from that time on, I decided I wanted to get on the ASAE board, that if people like Arlene were leading the organization, I wanted to be a part of that. And I remember that, I've always remembered that, and I thank her for, for her forthright, and she did that with everybody. It wasn't just me. Um, she did that with everyone. And I want to be just like that. And I want all of us to remember to go up to someone that you've not seen before, um, to welcome them to the community and encourage those people at every level of the organization. Because anyone could do what I'm doing now.